Okay, so I just arrived in Nepal. Take the short shuttle bus over to the arrival hall and we'll go through customs. We'll go over the visa purchasing process here once we're inside. Okay, so you just came through the arrival hall over here and there's tables right here with documentation on it to do the, your visas and those are uh, just like this form here that I filled out. You need a photo and a little bit of information. You're going to want to have a pen, a flight number, and uh, the name of the hotel where we stay, usually the Yak and Yeti. Um, they do have some new kiosks here that are for you to get your visa without a photograph. But um, I've been here before when they didn't work, so I usually walk right over to here with a photo and come to this area and you can uh, just purchase the visa you need. And then they do have some money exchange over here if you wanted to. You're usually good for the night. You can do that easily tomorrow in Kathmandu. And then you come right over to here and you go through customs. Pretty simple coming into Nepal. Easy way to uh, get your visa and deal with everything once you arrive. On a regular ever space camp truck, you're gonna get that up to 30 days US, $40. Good to have cash, obviously, and uh, just buy your visa. So just get my visa processed. And then you come right over here to the customs area. So right here you can see, uh, if you're just coming on a track, this is the line, it says 30 days, 30 day visa. Okay, so I got my uh, visa, my Nepalese visa. You give me a receipt, I'll put that in my wallet, and uh, head on downstairs to the uh, baggage claim area. Okay, just got my uh, visa, and uh, heading down to the baggage claim area. It is a good idea that when you arrive that you have your baggage claim tickets. When you pick up your bags and you go to exit the airport, they're gonna wanna check your claim stubs just to make sure that the baggage uh, that you have, they know is yours. Okay, let's just go over it again. So we arrived in Kathmandu and got off the flight, came in through the arrival hall. When you got in through the arrival hall, you'll see right on the left-hand side, there's some high desks with forms. You can fill out that form, you need your passport information, and you're also gonna need some information on what flight number you had. Then you're gonna go over straight ahead and you're gonna to go to the visa desk, hand in the paperwork. You're gonna tell them you want a 30-day visa if you're doing your Everspace Camp Trek. Now I'm down in the baggage arrival hall. Bags come out, there's carts right here that are free for you to just take and use and wheel on through. It's really important that you also have your baggage claim tickets. If you don't have your baggage claim tickets, they can give you a hassle. So have those in a convenient place. Welcome to Nepal. Okay, this is a perfect opportunity because um, they called me in the loudspeakers and one of my bags didn't come up. So I'm over here filling out my report. It's pretty easy. We're right here at the end of the uh, carousel like you're walking out the door and then you come on over and there's this uh, claim desk if I give him my um, baggage information I give him a description of my bag it's a black duffel bag I give him my uh, baggage claim ticket my passport and my boarding pass and my bag will be in tomorrow morning so it shouldn't be such a big deal so um, I even got to show you what to do in the event of a lost or delayed bag coming into Kathmandu, Nepal. So basically what I needed to do was come over to this desk right at the end of the baggage collection hall. And I give my passport number, boarding pass, my baggage tag, and we filled out this form right here. All I really need to let them know was that I'm staying at the Yak and Yeti and that it's a black duffel bag. They'll uh, have it here tomorrow. I'll send somebody over with this sheet. They'll pick it up and bring it to the hotel. So, um, minor inconvenience, I'm sure it'll be here in the morning. Okay, here we go, we're just going through the green channel and uh, they'll check my baggage tag to my luggage and walk outside. We should be meeting our ride. Once we walk outside, if you look across the street, you should see our, our guy. There's Gelgen right there. Hey! hey. <laughs> Namaste. Okay. This is Dean Cardinal with Worldwide Trekking. Thanks for watching our series on the trek to Mount Everest Base Camp.